when the narcissist wants you to return. It may seem like the narcissist is done with you. They may have discarded you and moved on to another situation. They may have met someone else. But then some time goes by and they contact you. They tell you they want you to return. Because once the narcissist has had some time away from you, it begins to feel fresh and new again. It's similar to the narcissist taking a drug again and again until it no longer has the same effect. But when they take some time away from the drug, they can then experience its true potency. This is what happens when the narcissist spends some time away from you. When they come back, everything feels new again. But this only lasts for a short amount of time. Because when a narcissist is around their supply, they demand all of their time and attention. They milk it for all it's worth until it no longer has the same effect on them. Until they get bored. But once the narcissist has spent some time away from you, they will want you to return. They will be waiting for an opportunity to lure you in again. They will want you to return if you were a good supply or if they want to get revenge on you for some perceived injury because these are the only reasons why the narcissist would want you to return. It's not because they miss you. It's not because they love you or care for you. It's all about them. It's all about how you can benefit them or make their lives more convenient. When the narcissist discards you, or if you leave them, it may seem like they're not interested in you. And for a moment, they may be preoccupied with other sources of supply. It may say, take some time until they finally hoover you. But when they get bored, they will want you to return. Even if they're just bringing you in to punish you. but they're not going to reveal their true intentions to you. Unless they know that you are no longer susceptible to their manipulation. If they know that you're not going to buy into the illusion, their mask will be off. They will show you exactly who they are. And they will use it to coerce you into returning to them. They will try to induce fear or shame within you. They will try to make you feel guilty. Because they're expecting that to make you give in. If the narcissist doesn't think that you're going to return to them. 
they will try to enmesh themselves into every aspect of your life. They will contact your family and friends and they will try to gain their trust and use them to do their bidding. They will start a smear campaign. Your family and friends may become the narcissist fly monkeys. And anything you say to them may go back to the narcissist. It may be difficult. But you may find that you have to cut off certain friends and family members. Because once the narcissist has infected them. They're going to be no good to you. They're just going to keep you connected to the narcissist. And the narcissist will use any information they give them to monitor you. To track your movements. And to plan what they're going to do next. When the narcissist wants you to return, they may play the victim. They may act like you or someone else did something to them, and now they're in an unfortunate situation. They may act like you abandoned them without help or support. They will make it seem as though you are the only one who can save them, as though there is nothing that anyone else can do for them. They will give you fake apologies and fake epiphanies. They will use future faking. They will do anything to get you to return. And because they know that you're an empath, they will assume that certain things will work on you. They will guilt trip you. They will give you sob stories. They will become attention whores where they will do anything to get your attention. The narcissist will always try to make you feel bad. They will always try to trigger your empathy because they see that as your weakness. They see it as something they can exploit so that they can get what they want. But they never felt bad for you. They never did anything to show that they care about you. Yet they expect it from you. While they use and abuse you. Which is why when the narcissist tries to get you to return. You need to pull away. Don't fall for their sob stories. Recognize that they are not worthy of your empathy. Because they're only going to take advantage of it. And then they will soon return to their old behaviors. They will hurt you again and again. Until you decide that you've had enough. It's only when you make that decision to close the door that it will finally come to an end. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at Narc Survivor, Dakota UK. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.